and welcome to EasyWP Localhost. In a moment, I'll show you the easiest and fastest way to build WordPress sites from the comfort of your PC or Mac, where you can build sites up to three times faster, where you can create, backup, and restore sites in one click, without ever breaking a site again, and without paying a cent for hosting or domains. But firstly, let me ask you a question. What makes the difference between earning zero and a thousand dollars a day online? The simple answer is we procrastinate. The minute we find something hard, have to learn something, break something, or have to pay for something, we put it off. Now we all buy really cool themes and plugins with good intentions, and they just end up sitting on our hard drive somewhere. I mean, to even get started, we've got to buy a domain, we've got to pay for hosting, we've got to set up a site using some weird script, and we've got to learn the theme or plugin we want to use. So we put it off till tomorrow, mañana. Now that's not how professionals do it. They all build sites offline using local hosts. These are much faster. There's none of that internet lag and no one ever sees your mistakes. But no matter which one you try, they're all hard to install and use. The installation can take hours. You have to create databases, you have to edit PHP files and go through a technical procedure that will make your eyes water. And that's just to install one site. Well, not anymore. It's taken us over a year to create a local host which installs in seconds, both on PC and Mac, as you can see in the installation videos below. And now with EasyWP Localhost, you can install WordPress sites in just one click. You can install unlimited number of sites, unlike other installers, and you can back up and restore sites in seconds. Let me show you. So once you've installed the product, you can go to any browser and type the word localhost in the URL bar and press enter. And you're gonna to get to the EasyWP Localhost Manager. Now, as you can see, there's two buttons here. One's called New Site, and the other one's called the Import Site. This Import section is only available in the Pro version, which we'll discuss later. So I'm gonna go into New WP Site, and automatically it uh, shows me the latest version available in, in my repository, and I'm gonna type a folder name, and I'm gonna create the site. And there you go, that's it, job done. Now just to show you that the product is actually working, I'm gonna go into the, the site itself. And as you can see, it's starting the installation process, which I'm gonna fill in now. And I'm ready to install. And as you can see, the site is working. So I'm just gonna go and refresh the main homepage. And as you can see, that's a standard default version of WordPress. Now this site is gonna work exactly the same as it would do on a real server, with exception that it's gonna be a lot faster. And as long as you're connected to the internet, you'll be able to install your themes, plugins, and updates the regular way. But by far the most important feature in the EasyWP Localhost is the ability to back up and restore a site. So let me show you that function now. I'm not gonna back up this project that we just worked on, just by pressing back up here. And I'm gonna break the site willfully by installing a dodgy plugin. And I happen to have one which will do that job perfectly. I'm now gonna activate this plugin and bingo, my site is now broken. Now, if this was a real site, your site will be down, you'll be losing money, and most likely you would need to log into your FTP to remove the dodgy plugin, assuming it hasn't corrupted your database. If it has, your only hope is a backup. Now, most people don't back up when they're building sites on a live server because it takes too long. So you probably have to start again from scratch. Now let me show you how easy it is to restore a site on EasyWP Localhost. All I need to do is go to Restore, find the latest backup, and press the Restore button. Now I'm gonna to go to the same site, and as you can see, we're back up and operational again. And that took seconds. Okay, so that's pretty much the standard version of EasyWP Localhost Manager covered. So those, those three buttons here, and that button there comes as standard. Now these three buttons here are upgrades to the product, which I'm gonna run through now. Now these upgrades will be offered to you after purchase, but I'm gonna give you a little glimpse as to the kind of things you'd be able to do with the extra toys that we have built for the product. Now, the first one is import WP sites. So that comes together with a plugin that you install on a WP site, and in this case is installed on my website. Now, all we really wanna do is to be able to download a site from a live server to a local host or upload one from a local host to a live server. And we wanted to do that 
in the simplest possible way. So let me show you how it works. So the plugin itself, as you can see, I've got it installed on my Hitman Publishing site, and you have an import and export function. Now, I've pressed the export button earlier, and that's generated me a link just here. And I've downloaded the file it's created straight to my PC. Okay, I'm now going to go to my local host manager, and I'm going to press the import site button. Now it's going to ask me for a folder name. I'm going to call it Hitman. And I'm going to select the file I wish to import just here. And watch how fast this works. And that's it, job done. So I'm just going to go into the site itself to show you that it's actually worked. And as you can see, that's a copy of my site. So I'm just going to go to my site as well just to show you that it's a real site and it's exactly the same. And there you go, that's my site live on my server. And we're proud to say this is actually the fastest and easiest way to clone a live site to and from a local host. Okay, so one final thing, just going to run you through, and that's these two buttons here. These come with a developer pack. Now, if you press the button here, as you can see, what I've got is a selection of themes and plugins that I own or I've downloaded from the WordPress repository already available to me. And all I ever need to do is press a few checkboxes and these will be instantly added to my project. So all I need to do is just press the install button and let's go to the site, the admin area, plugins, and as you can see, they're here. Now we estimated that we lost about 20 or 30 minutes per site doing all the plugin installation and downloads manually. So this is a huge time saving. And one final thing in our local host manager, just gonna go back to that now. We've got this duplicate site option. Now, majority of the projects that you'll be working on will have similar pages, similar setup, similar configuration. And all you ever need to do when you have a project like that is click on duplicate site. I'm going to click here and call it another name. I'm going to call it test three and clone site. And that generates an exact copy of the site that I've just been working on. So that was very easy. Now, as you have seen, we have created a site, we have broken a site, we have restored a site, and we have cloned a site to our local host. And we did all this in minutes. So with EasyWP Localhost, you'll be able to build sites much faster, make no costly live mistakes, learn and use the products that you've bought, and waste less on hosting and domain fees. And as building sites is gonna be a lot easier, you'll procrastinate less and make more money. Now, as this product is brand new to the market, we have a special offer on it for you too. So on behalf of myself, Chris Hitman, and Michael Thomas, the product developer, thanks for watching, and we wish you the best of success in your site building projects.